People are experiencing visions of a radiant song all across Azeroth. We have Meet Me in Silithus. Perhaps Azeroth's speaker can shed some light on what this warning might mean. Oh, what could it mean? So that's what I was trying to get. So if you delete your, your scroll, it comes back on. So that was the point of that. So she's already done um, the Harbinger quest, so she doesn't have to worry about that. So she just, just can go right in. However, she can't just start doing the, um, the Radiant Echoes quest. Which, by the way, um, side note, uh, I am using this it's a weak aura basically tells you how much how much um it goes <laughs> keep forgetting what it's called uh that you have how many you have across the you know the across the warband that's warband um when the next one is coming up well which one is up now and how long it has to be up and then which one is next so it, it's simple, it's, it's simple, it's handy, it's been, you know, keeping me sane. That's the, on the other thing that just popped up is the, um, is the Dragonfly events, which I turned off for the sake of the stream, because I am still doing some of it for, uh, Crest. But the one that I am, that is this, is Radiant Echoes, yes, it's Radiant Echoes. Radiant Echoes event timer on the World Within pre-patch. So it's been very useful. And it, you know, it's, it's an obtrusive, it stays up off to the side and just helps me keep track of what's going on and if I want to drop in or not. So she now has to go to Silithus, pretty straightforward. Um, let's take our scroll to Silithus. Another vision. You saw it too. They're growing stronger. I was hoping that with a week gone by, it'd be less crowded, but it is a Saturday. <laughs> anyway, it's going to be cozy in here. So, we'll get to him in a second. So, Jaina and Thrall are here. Um, if you're Alliance, you go to Jaina. If you're Horde, you go to Thrall. But you end up talking to both of them. It's just how you get introduced. If you, we'll talk to Thrall first. Well met. Uh, never before has Azeroth called out so strongly to us, and despite the radiance of these visions, I fear that there's a dark reason. Play move me, re move me, play movie. Remind me of the events so far. We'll get to that in a sec. Together. We are strong. Jaina, Locust Walker, told us that the people of his homeworld once received a vision not unlike the Radiant Psalm, and then Koresh fell to shadow. By the time the Ethereals realized their world was warning, that warning them of the coming danger was already too late. We cannot allow the same to happen on Azeroth. So, and then you would hand it in, but we'll do it in a second. She also gets the option to play the movie. Now, you'll get this option well through to the end of this, this intro text. I'm assuming at some point it will disappear. But for now, you always have this option. You can play it over. So you don't have to do it right now. Uh, what she's talking about here, Locust Walker, and it'll replay in here, the movie, if you you play that, um, is what happens in the Harbinger quest. So if you played the Har Harbinger quest, that's what she's referring to. Meanwhile, look who's over here. Post. Oh, hello. Nice to see you. What's up? Anduin. So if you talk to him, vigilant. note the language here. Um, it has been too long, my friend. It seems destiny has brought us both here. They're calling it the Radiant Song, yet it fills me with dread. Where have you been? Anduin smiles wearily. Nowhere in particular, no need for a destination when I was only trying to run from my kingdom, from the Alliance, from myself. But I was sent this vision for a reason. I can't keep running. Not from this. So, you'll notice... You are always welcome in Stormwind. They need to update the... <laughs> 
they need to update the, those little clips. He keeps talking about Stormwind and it's like, and it. Please don't tell me to enjoy my stay in Stormwind when we're sitting in Silithus. And you haven't seen Stormwind in a while. Anyway, it's been too long, my friend. That, I mean, that's the key part. Um, I don't know what triggers it, but that dialogue does change uh, depending on something. I'm not entirely sure what. I've done this on a few other characters. Uh, he will say something different to someone he wouldn't quote unquote note well, know well. Someone's got an Usher Kamas in there. I wonder if they're actually doing the, uh, the BFA quest. Um, cloak quest. Um, so he will say uh, something slightly different, which we'll see. I have a character all queued up for that. But he will say this, and he says it to Horde 2. When I go on Matori, I'll show you. He says it to Horde 2. Um, if they, he knows the character. Now, what determines Anduin knowing you? You know, calling you friend, knowing you? I mean, people throw friend around here rather, you know, <laughs> generously. But anyway, um, when they don't want to use champion for everything, where champion would just be weird. It's a friend, real friends here? Uh, what faction war? Um... I don't know what it is. It's not Shadowlands quest completion, because he calls characters that never step foot in Shadowlands, except maybe to get like their profession, um, friend. Um, that means that character must. Well, well, another character that has done more in Shadowlands doesn't get that. Um, it's not I don't it's not Horde or Alliance because there I have Horde characters he says that to. Uh for a while I thought it might have been Mists of Pandaria, which is an odd determinant. Or maybe there's a point system that determines it. Like if if I either these or these two or whatever are met, then dialogue change. If when then. Um But it's not Pandaria. I don't think, because there are characters that definitely got further in Pandaria who did quests with him in Pandaria uh, that didn't get it, um, which I thought was weird. But then again, it may not go back that far. I don't know what it is. But it's kind of cool. I do like it. I like that the dialogue is tweaked depending on, you know, it It helps with immersion that a character that, oh, I don't know, our Leia went on cow murder investigations with him. <laughs> You know, um, he was still a little kid in, uh, in, uh, in Stormwind saying, welcome to Stormwind. Are you enjoying your stay, citizen? So, I mean, um, she's known Anduin since she first dipped in Stormwind. So, yeah, it's much better for the immersion. It's just a little weird. I don't know. I don't know what determines it. Um, I'd love to know, just for nerdy reasons. Um what triggers the dialogue change. Anyway, last time I saw you, Andrew, was in Oribos. <laughs> You're having a bit of a time of it. Um, though I will say Victory what is funny is... Light. What I will say is... Um, Oh god, what the hell is it? I was gonna. S <laughs> I got distracted by the giant torrent walking in front of me, and I was like, please tell me you're not gonna stand there now. Um. It'll come back to me. So, um. Do, 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 do. What? Anyway, we'll just continue. So, Anduin, <laughs> last time I saw you was nervous, uh, and you were going doing your thing, you disappeared, you weren't fooling anybody, both, you know. SI7 and uh, Black Talons were tracking you. It's, you know, that's in the, the short story. Um, that was recently came out. Uh, and, um, hmm. Look a little ragged there. Look a little ragged there, Andy. You know what you could use? I think you could use a new cloak. That's what I think you should use. You know what? Rathian says hello. <laughs> Have I been waiting weeks to do this? Yes. <laughs> Apologies.
<laughs> anyway. Um, let's continue with this. I am goofy as fuck. I apologize. And doing go get a coach. Come on now. There are people I'm sure who will appreciate will appreciate that that get it. Possibly no one here in this crowd of of uh, of labels. Okay, Jaina High. The long road lies before us. Locus Walker told us that the people of this home world once to... okay, we we read this already. Um so let's turn in the quest, the war within. I will never forget. We all have our ghosts. Loptar. Let Look at what honor said to me. guide your path. The What's time for dreaming is over. Oh, just the same thing. Okay. Dromkar. A poor reception. For Azeroth. There's strong evidence that the Radiant Song is a warning from Azeroth herself. A cry for help. That's why we're here. If this vision truly is Azeroth's message, Magni will know what she's trying to tell us. He should be in the Chamber of the Heart. Let's go. Go to the Heart Chamber to ask Magni for help deciphering the Radiant Song. Let all Let's hope Magni has some answers. I hear no one's seen him for a few years. He'll be there. He has to be. Loptar. Together, we I'm not playing the movie yet. For the Alliance, no. above all. For the Alliance. See, he's, he's not there. Oh, now I remember what I was going to say. <laughs> Seems appropriate. So before I go in. Um, it's interesting, the running away part that he mentions. You keep running away. Because what did he do a lot of, if you play Remix, or you remember Pandaria at all, what did he do a lot of? He ran away a lot. <laughs> Nearly got himself killed. Been there's got knocked out more times than I can count. <laughs> so, you know, running away is a thing that he's done, and it's not the only time I referred to the cow murders or quest. That's the um, that's, I believe it's in Cataclysm. I thought it was pre-patch. I may be wrong about that. I have to investigate that in Cataclysm Classic. Um. Because I don't, I don't think it's in the game anymore, but okay. I don't know. Uh, I think it's the introduction to Twilight Highlands, but I'll, I have not there yet. So, I've only played so many WoWs at once. But, um... Sure, just hang out. Cool. We're all here just hanging out. Um... They're getting close. So, um... So yeah, so he did a lot of running away in this Pandaria. area. Uh, so it, I just, I keep trying to, I, I realize that Miss Pandaria was probably one of the easiest ones to do remix with, and that's probably the reason. But part of me wonders that there has to be some thinking that went on behind the scenes, like, how does this tie into the war with it? And it does in the sense that blood of the old gods yasharaj uh factors heavily in pandaria um andarin getting hurt while trying to broker peace it's, this is obviously a big anduin story um i don't know the real reason why uh but i'm curious to see if, if it becomes more evident as we go anyway let's go in that I've done my service and left the armor of endless cloaks. Uh, if you don't know what the armor of endless cloaks is, it's what you get for maxing out rep with Rathian, um, the Obsidian Citadel. And the description is as follows: You have to access Rath you have access to Rathian's personal cloak collection. Um, <laughs> and then there's a there's a comment here when meeting the Black Prince, you must preserve the proper image. I find it funny that there's a toy um, that's like, here, just just access my cloaks. And the fact that he has something for that purpose makes all the sense in the world. And ironically. Um, here we go. 
Magni. We've it's been trying to or fly. Nope. If this is about the visions, I'm not interested. Leave me alone. Azeroth needs its speaker, and so do we. So I've done this in a few characters now. I, I did in the beta too, but it kept crashing on me, so I'm not counting that. But every time I come in here, these three have a different way that they approach this area. There, there's something in the pathing that's a, a little off. Jaina always floats. I don't think she's supposed to float. I don't think she's levitating. Um, I did see her walk up the stairs once. I saw her walk up the stairs once. There was one time where Anduin was, Anduin was already there, waiting for the rest of them. So, the most consistent one I've seen is, uh, they walk, Jaina fly, Jaina floats, Jaina levitates. Uh, but, you know, it, it's fine. It's not a serious bug. I'm just amused every time I do it. Anyway, you may have noticed Magni's in a bad mood. <laughs> Uh, and there's a lot of people right now, so I don't know if we can get a good look at him here. But you may notice he's not as shiny as he was. He's not going to... You'll notice there's a different change in tone if he did BFA. Well, out with it. I got no counsel for you. No advice. I know why you're here. It's the visions of... Hazrod's voice, heard all across the land. You thought I would know what she's trying to tell us, but you thought wrong. I'll press on till Hazaroth is done with me. I haven't spoken with Hazaroth for years. At first I just didn't feel the need. Then I realized I'd started to resent her for leaving me like this. And now I'm not sure if I can. But I know the stakes. This radiant song of hers foretells something dire, and we need to know what. First, we need to prepare the heart chamber. Can you start up the consoles nearby? Help Magni perform his ritual. Oh, in case you haven't been paying attention with the warbands, you now get told your warband previously completed this quest, but you can still run through the quest yourself. You're just, no, someone else has already done this. But it could be anyone in your warband, so, no, no. Look, it's an early Saturday evening, and I live on a busy avenue, so there are going to be sirens. It's a hospital. It's on the path to the hospital. I apologize. So let's accept. Always more work to be done. For Azeroth. <laughs> Look, I'm not dead yet. Speak up. Even now, I'm bound to serving Azeroth. I'm speaking for no one these days. If you're trying to polish me, put a wee bit more elbow grease in. Here, see? Wax on, wax off. Wax on, wax off. Even now, I'm bound to serving Azeroth. Speaker of Azeroth. <laughs> she hasn't been speaking to me. Gave. She left me like this, unable to feel the warmth of my kin's embrace. So, let's be clear. I'm doing this for all of you, not for her. Clearly, he's not happy. This will be a struggle, but I'm a bit rusty with the whole speaking with the soul of our world thing. But the ritual is prepared, and that's that, I suppose. I'll try speaking with him. Though I warn you, champion, 
It might be for the last time. Are you ready? Oh, it's my pet Scottish accent. Keep fighting. Azeroth! Speak to me! What are you trying to tell us? I can hear her voice! I can see it! The place she's calling us to! Where, Magni? Where must we go? It's cold! Magni! He's alive, but barely. Good. All right. We cannot let the world fall to darkness. The Alliance will endure. This has never happened before. Magni is the speaker of Azrael. Why would communing with her cause him to collapse? I know what must be done. Painful A darkness. single spark Let's to everybody can else. set the world So flame. Magni is here on the floor, under... By end of its hard to see because of the Storm people. Will endure. Magni's wounds are beyond my knowledge. We need to consult the mages of Dalaran. Never lose hope. From Khan. Perhaps we took Magni's powers for granted after all this time. Communing with the elements is dangerous enough. But to commune with an entire world. Well, they hope we were quite So we still, we're still presenting the movie option. Just so you, just so you know. For Azeroth. Control your power. Magni appears stable for now. We'll control you. But he's still not responsive. We need to get him treatment quickly. I'll open a portal to Dalaran. Follow us when you can. Take the portal to Dalaran. Thank you, thank you for the gold, silver, and copper for it. I will accept. A single spark can set. Hopefully, we can revive him. Meet us in Dalaran when you're able. They all hurt the Darnalan? Darnalan? Dalaran? Darnalan? Darnalan? Dalaran! They all just took off! I wouldn't speed your hurt like that. He tried to commune directly with Azeroth. It seems the strain was too much. Oh, da! What have you done to yourself this time? We will defend Azeroth together. You see, Khadgar also has the play. Remind me of the event so far. Don't worry, we'll play it soon. Um, troubling times lie ahead, but don't they always? At least we can face them together. Painful lessons. Remain vigilant. I'm unsure why the Speaker of Azeroth would end up in such a state after attempting to, well, speak with Azeroth. All we can do is wait for Maggie to recover. Always happy to help. You speak to them. A king is only as noble as Magnus the causes stable he serves. for now, but I don't know how long it will be for him to. It will take for him to recover. At least he's with family. Be vigilant. Well met. I don't believe we should blame Azeroth for this outcome. Magni knew the risks of connecting with her, with such reluctance in his heart. Now we can only hope that he is able to. He was able to hear her message in the end. I'll comment that in a moment. Let honor guide your path. And you know, they still they still offer the movie too. Magni will recover. He must, and not just because he's, he is a dear friend. We need to learn what Azeroth told him before it's too late. We now, all have our ghosts. See if I can actually cue this up properly. Um, I am going to talk to uh, to uh, Moira in a second. Because uh, it's a lovely little bit, and and this whole part is very quick. So well, it's just one thing I wanna I wanna point out and see if I can actually cue this up correctly. Uh, I'm gonna mute myself while I do. So the so one thing that reminded me of the whole Magni uh, Magni scene um, when he's like, we, we have place we have to go to is, is my my brain went immediately to Monty Python and the Holy Grail as it often does.
The mountain lends us its strength. Moira takes a deep, centering breath. We need to let Bran and my son Dagnar know what happened. They're at Dalaran's visitor center. Could you go get them for me? Father needs his family right now. Head to Bran and Dagnar in the Dalaran visitor center to inform them of what has happened to Magni. You'll receive 20 gold and 9 silver. We will s- oh, You'll likely find Dagnar with his nose in a book. It's why he insisted we come to Dalaran. I already like Dagger. Um, Father, Da, what have you gotten yourself into this time? You can't leave us like this. Please be all right, you old coot. And you have a stay a while and listen. And I really like this one, so we're going to stay a while and listen. Mind yourself now. Listen, you old coot. I know you always meant right by me. You didn't know. But I chose to stay with the Dark Irons. That Dagrin and I were in love. Whatever your intentions were, my husband died. Because of you, I hated you for taking him from me. My anger built a wall neither of us could ever get through. And now, we may never get the chance. But my son, my little Dagrin, he needs you. I guess so do I, loath as I am to admit it. You were never the best father, but you can still be a good granda. So please, wake up. I love Moira's voice actress. I love, I, she's great. Um. And, I mean, if you know anything about the story behind the air, you know, Magni, when Magni was king, one of the earliest quests in Vanilla was um, to go rescue Moira. Later on, that changed. <laughs> What's the cataclysm? He became a diamond. So uh, that quest line changed a bit, and she was no longer down there. But, uh, yeah, so that was... It's going back a ways, but he was not a great father. He's like, you can't rule. You're, you're a woman. Can't do that. Um... I'm, you know, was kidnapped but fell in love with uh, Dagran, and uh, they had a little kid who's now grown, and we shall see him in a second, and he's great. Don't worry, we're gonna view the video. At least this video I can play because it's in the game. My God, no, it's down there. We're not going down there. But let's see. Let's go find Bran. Bran and Dagran. So this is the um. This is the Legion version of Dalaran. In case you'd be curious. Obviously, this is not in the uh, the uh, Lich King version. Ice cream version. The uh, Marathon version. Um. Have you seen these new tomes, Uncle Bran? They must be from Drenton's library. I read about this. He has a great voice. Let's look at him. Let's take a good look at him with all those scrolls. Look at him. Oh, hello there. Are you to chat with Uncle Bran? Sorry. But look at his scrolls here, because I noticed the other day. He's a dark guyer, so he's got all that fire blood going on. He's got scrolls that are on fire. I spend entirely too much time thinking about how your scrolls on fire and still existing. Anyway. Let's talk to Bran. Bran is going to be your partner in Delves for the first first patch, so that should be fun. Lords of forgotten knowledge. Hey there, oh, champion. Wait. Dagra and I were just perusing the local books and whatnot. Lad couldn't be more excited for his first visit to Dalaran. What brings you here? Quest Magni's hurt Echo of light. That was. Um, Magni's hurt. Moira needs you both in the, in the portrait room. Uh, so let me chase him out. Now you. Travel I don't know if you noticed I when. Oh, uh, Granda's all right. I never got to spend much time with him. Don't worry, lad. 
Magni's made of stern stuff. Uh, pardon the pun. Here in um, Chamber of the Guardian, it's a mishmash of different things. Um, over here is where you met Illyria to do the Harbinger quest line. If you go here, Kagar's not here. If once you do it, he's no longer there. You don't have uh, totally not sus mage over there talking about how he's going to use his power. You better believe it. So yeah. And then once I'm done right here, right now, I will play the movie. Another puzzle to solve? Randa has been through way worse than this. I know he'll wake up soon. He has to. I'll contemplate what we talked about. Magni looking a little, a little dingy. Still holding his hammer. That's a true dwarf for you. Um, Softer brand. Inquiring minds just Magni got really, to know. Magni really mucked the bedroll with this one, didn't he? Couldn't leave well enough alone. Well, I know that's not really his way. Not when the world is at stake. Muck the bedroll. Um is a nice way of saying shit the bed. Mm. Glad I could put that together for you. It's struggling. Uh, don't do anything I wouldn't do. <laughs> Randomly punch buttons and get us killed? Sure. You need a hammer? Or an open hand? Father, da. We got, okay. She said before, please buy right, you okay. So let's do the bronze bed. Hammer. May your hammer strike true. It's good for us all. Good uh, for us to all be in one room together, even if the reason is so dire. My father ain't oh, really been a part of Dagoran's life, but I mean to change that. You have my word. Thank you, Ilaria. The three hammers stand as one. So that's it for that part of the quest line. And then this is where Cadgar offers uh, to do the... Um, Radiant Echoes quest, which I will do some of them because they're fun. Um, but let's play the movie before we do that. She asked Jaina. The true battle lies Should ahead. we ask Thrall? Should we ask Together, Kadgar? Let's ask Kadgar. We are strong. All right. Memories of Adventures Past. I'm going to mute myself for this. Me. From the moment the dark titan Sargeras plunged his colossal blade into our world, crucial events were set in motion. Magni Bronzebeard heard the cries of Azeroth, giving up everything to answer her call. Since being wounded by the mad titan, Azeroth has been crying out in pain. As her dutiful speaker, he rallied the champions to her aid, and ultimately, to confront the return of the old god, Nizar. It was during this conflict that Zalatev, a mysterious entity of the Void, made a deal with Nizar, freeing her from the cursed blade that bound her essence within. Honor our bargain. Free me to find my own fate. After she vanished into the darkness, Nizar was confronted by the mortal champions and destroyed. Ending the old god's reign of terror. But they were not the only malevolent force with its eyes set on Azeroth. For soon, the sky was sundered, the Shadowlands split open, and our heroes were pulled into the realm of death itself. Go, champion! Go! It was there that Anduin Rin endured the worst. Captured, tortured, and through dark domination magics, forced to commit terrible acts against his will. I'm afraid that if I call on the light, it won't answer. Scarred and shaken by his experience, he vanished, his whereabouts unknown. After the threat of the Shadowlands had been quelled, the dragons of Azeroth returned to their ancestral homeland. It was here that the primal dragon Iridicron broke free of his prison and in pursuit of vengeance upon the titans who he felt had stolen our world. 
he secured an ancient, powerful artifact. The Dark Heart. When the Titans come to reclaim their prize, I will be waiting. As word of this new threat started to spread, people began experiencing strange visions. The Radiant Song is being heard all across Azeroth. The Council doesn't know what to make of it. It was then that Illyria Windrunner, a deadly huntress who had harnessed the powers of the Void as a weapon against the darkness, was summoned to investigate. We still don't know what this Dark Heart relic is capable of, but we do know it's in the hands of someone called the Harbinger. It was not long before Illyria discovered the Harbinger's true identity. Zalatath, the mysterious figure, was once again on the move. While neither Zalatath nor the Dark Heart could be found, her mentor, the enigmatic Locust Walker, issued Illyria a dire warning. The radiant visions you spoke of are the very same my people had before our world was consumed by the Void Lord Dementius. Could Zalatath be seeking that same fate for Azeroth? You must find a way to stop her. If you cannot, then Azeroth is already doomed. So I like... So... I like the idea of having, like, a summary clip. I approve of that. Great deal. Um, I like that that's there. I like that it's an option. And at this point, Cad, Garth, Rall, and Jaina both have it as an option. Um, I think it's good to catch folks up on anything they may have forgotten about. It's a good summary. I find it very funny that the Jailer is completely excluded from the show. <laughs> it's part of it. But, you know, it touched on the important parts. If you notice, there were different versions of Anduin's theme woven throughout his scenes. Um, for some reason, deciding to focus on Rathian when talking about Magni. <laughs> I don't know why. He certainly had plenty of his own scenes. Um, but sure. <laughs> Whatever. Not complaining, but I just thought that was because I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> the camera shifts. Damn. So it's like, Magni had lots of scenes in that expansion. Why did you jump there? I really they jump right to the Nazoth part of it. So clearly, you know, drawing the parallels. Um, they even show uh, Rathian with Zalatath Blade going into Nazoth. So the, I guess, you know, maybe the. Though if you don't know those scenes, how are you going to piece them together? Anyway, um, I think it was well done. I think it's very good to use. I would like to see something like that done more often. Catching people up who forget those details and don't upset some of them, like some of us. Uh, I think it's a good idea. No complaints. I'm happy with it. So now Kangar has the quest, which is basically the Radiant Echoes there quest. There remains much to be done. Um, memories of adventures past. It is past. a world of wonder. It seems that Azeroth has grown agitated. Something must have happened when Magni tried to commune with her. Past events have now come to life once once more. I believe they're Azeroth's memories. Memories they may be. These radiant echoes are all too real and can cause serious danger if left unattended. I ask that you investigate one of them and help however you can. Go to the portrait room in Dalaran and use a glowing portal to join a, radi join a Radiant Echoes event. Once it begins, kill the area boss to complete the event. So you have to kill the one of the bosses. Your duty. bosses are... And this is the this is the, officially now the pre-patch event. Um, which you can't get to if you're level 70 and haven't... Until you do the first part of it. It's a little weird, it's a little backwards. So the event that's at, you're in this room, you may remember it. The Void Portal is still here to uh, Telegris. Uh, if you've done um, the Harbinger Quest. If you haven't, this isn't here. There's a lot of things to click on. So, 
interestingly, these portals are not here for her. Um, they are for other characters, but for her, it's only these three. Um, one is Karazhan, the ones that are here, Karazhan, and also Dalaran Crater, which you will die unless you have something to break your fall. But what you have is uh, Searing Gorge. The end boss of that is Ragnaros, Ragnaros. and it deals it deals a lot with um, Eastern Kingdoms quests. Um, over here is, is what you see the echoes of. Here's Dustwallow Marsh. You fight Anixia, and it has uh, Kalimdor quests, including um, Kaldurai starting quests. Uh, you'll recognize it if you you've played Night Elf. And here you have, of course, Ice Crown. Um, you have Dragon Blight. Uh, the final boss of this is um, Lich King. Um, which makes two events currently, if you count the the Time Rift uh, quest running in Dragonflight, uh, where there's a fight, there's a boss that is the Lich King, and people will continue to stand into fire and spread it. That'll happen again. No, however, this Virgin Lich King's Defile gives you a chance to run out of the group, but they, guess what doesn't happen? People running out of the group? Doesn't happen. Doesn't happen. Uh, I was trying to get to the... Uh, Where's the chat on here? Before I do this. Slow though. No, that's not the best. No, shield mode. Uh, we changed. Oh, it's down here. It seems to confuse the heck out of me. Okay. The new mobile app is confuses me and I'm still getting used to it. So alright, let's go here to we might as well do Dustwell Marsh, see if we can get a Nixia kill in. So you have to kill the boss of the area. The problem is is that well the well 83%. Okay, gives us a chance to walk around. So if you've been over here before and how did she have a quest she didn't do here? That's annoying. What can I do for you? See this might lady. be a, a cata thing added afterwards. There's some quests I still haven't done. So when you first come in, well, there's a couple of things before we do the. We have time. We're at 78 percent. When we just zeros, when Anixia is up. So here you have Forgotten Hero. I'm trying to remember who he's supposed to be. Um, so they've sped them up. It was far more spaced out. There's a daily in which you kill a boss in each area. There's also an achievement for doing that. Um, but the daily allows you there's basically it's three dailies, one for each boss, and you get a nice big chunk of echoes for that. Um, I've already done that today in another character. So you can do that daily. It resets well here in New York City. It resets at 11 a.m. That's all I know. But I think it's uh, 7 a.m. Uh, blues time. So, that's every day. And then the thing is that you fly around to Echo to Echo event, and you finish it off, and you get some Echoes, and um, but you can spend on gear. But right now, this is, um, you may remember the quest that used to be over here. We're in Dustwall Marsh. There's Theramore. I wonder if Theramore might be phased to destructed Ther Theramore. I don't know. Let's take a quick look over there to see what state Theramore is it. Oh yeah, Theramore because she had done it. Um, the quest line. Theramore is in the destroyed state for her. Um, there is a uh, Zdormi is here. She can swap it back if you want to see it before then. She's happy to do so. If you fly all the way out to Alcaz Island, you will get dismounted, just so you know. 
So be prepared to like have this one bit, bit, bit back. Um, don't do what I do. I'm gonna step over here for a second. I wonder what Azeroth is trying to tell us with these echoes. Cadgar will comment when you enter each area. Uh, I, the first time I got so confused because up near the top you'll see radiant echoes and there's a thing that looks like the radiant echo thing. I kept trying to fly to it and it always is telling me those are radiant echoes. <laughs> Don't do that. So we're gonna, this one is um, Quillmore. Clearly it's, the area should look familiar. I forget the exact quest other than killing Quillmore. There was plenty of those. So you're killing Quillmore over here. And I'm on a character that's not going to die instantly, so... And each area here should have a completion level, but I don't know what it is for this one, other than to keep killing Globor. And as long as this little radiant echo is up here, I mean, well, you'll know, because everything, all the echoey stuff will disappear. Be aware people flag for PvP. I think it's accidental in most cases. But this being, you know, wow, chances are there are people that are trying to trick others into PvP. And these little events cycle through, like, once you do this one, it may even show up in the same... Yeah, you'll see that little flash of light, and then it'll disappear from your mini-map, and everything else around you. And then you go to the next one. I'm gonna see if I can go out. A little, I'm, if you fly cl near Anixia's lair, he will, like... Mention a little more about a little, little, little bit about that. The memory of Anixia and her brood looms over these marshes still. So he says that just like that's your general zone. Now, this is the deviant delights. There, this one at least has a counter on it. As you're killing them, they put costumes on you. I am now I am now a ninja. I think this is Wailing Caverns. Is this, this is the reminder? It's all early game content. Lich King, I think, being the most recent that's in these echoes. It's a lot of the And it does tie into the anime, so... There's no major bosses area, but there are elites. You get, like, five echoes from them. Now I've got three. You get multiple. I've got pirate. I got ninja. I got two ninja. I got two ninjas on me now. I'm super ninja, super pirate. Yeah. I get what I got another pirate. I got two two doses of pirate. Two doses of ninja. Okay. This we should finish this one soon. Now leveling up in this area in this during these is ridiculous. It happens so fast. It isn't even funny. It's ridiculous. Now over here, I believe there are I wonder what Azeroth is trying to tell us with these echoes. Swamp eyes, spider eyes. So this is um smolder web. Which I remember this quest. Why can't I hit it? I don't know what was going on. There. I know I was still mounted, so I was confused. Uh, 
I'm just now just trying to get a look at them before Anixia shows up. Anixia. Ah, Anixia's there. The brood um, mother of the black was, dragon flight. This was from, um, we must take her oh, down. Okay. Fine. Let's take Anixia down. There's only three minutes left to Dust Fall on Mars, so I will get to um, at least do I'll do one round of Lich King because it it's like an hour, it's like 45 minutes to an hour, and I don't want to keep doing this for that long. I don't need to. So she fears you. They also nerfed her to be a little bit more difficult first. Yes, they're all rubs, many of them have rubs. She winged up and she, she does all the attacks. But then fucked her engine back. So she was going down real fast. I mean, they all were just going down. To the point of where there was a danger of her showing up and then she would be dead. Even if you were across the map. Not like one shot with her. There were a lot of people like that right now. So the bosses often drop loot. We'll look at that. I'm going to go back to the... Since I did the quest, I'm going to report back to Khadgar. You don't get anything for it. It's just quest completion. We overcame this once, and we will once more. So we're going to fly around just to see the little things he says, different things he says before I go back to the room. So he says that... Here we go again. Quite literally. Word up. Exactly. The boss is the Jerry that you should have done. If you're below 70, you get the sturdy recruit here. It's if you get alliance, you get a full horn. If you can't get a full alliance, um, once you're above 70, that move doesn't drop anymore. But they do provide good upgrades as you're, if you're using this level. The problem is for mods. Is once you're 70, you can't get it. So if you're trying to get all the mods for that, you should probably freeze a level and try to gather them. And if you get leather, you get it for plate, you get it for chain, so you don't have to worry about that. It's the weapons mostly that are in the And the shield. There's a shield. Um, there's a shield, there's a bow, there are swords. I don't know if I have the bow. I'll have to check that on a hunter. I may have to bring out a hunter that's low level that I wasn't planning on leveling. All right, I was gonna cruise some more areas. Let's see. Over here is. I wouldn't call this particular echo radiant. This is from Ungaro. The crystals down here. Um, there are crystals around the edges. You can see the pylons here. That's what this is in reference to. And you basically have to, just have to keep getting crystals and putting them in these pylons. Over here, you'll see it. Uh, this is a reference to... I here think we also go Ungaro, again. King Mosh. Or at least from here, I don't know. The raptors here, I don't remember. Smolder of Edgar's from here. Oh, and gone. It's actually over now in this area, so I can't show them. There are, however, lingering echoes now show up. Lingering memories. So you can now kind of like mess around with those if you're in the area. You just want something extra to do while you're there. So here we have, and they're the same things. So 
But you, you don't get the commentary. Spiders and whatnot. So we're gonna go now to the next area, which is Dragonflight. Well, first we're gonna hand in our quest. No, we're gonna hand in our quest. You can buy stuff off him. I would just all the quest giver, the 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 daily quest giver in each of the three zones has items they give you, but they're they have only one pet for one. Just go to the guy in Dalaran because he has all the pets. Him, this this dude. Uh, God. All right. I hope you find something useful. Remembrancer Amul. With the resurgence of the ancient Azarothian threats, we must sorry, we must look to the past to better understand our future. Do not dismiss your history so hastily. There is still much power with these once revolutionary relics. So, let's take a look at what's offered before we hand it in. There's a mount. If you get the Griffin, you're going to get the Wyvern. So, you get the Horde and the Alliance. Um. There is a regular 32 slot bag. There is recruits region bags. So you can get an upgraded region bag, 32. Here are your pets. There's remembered spawn. That's obviously Anixia. Uh, Construct. That's Lich King. And River Paw is from. That doesn't seem right. Oh, Hogger, yeah, um, is from, uh, is, is from, um, uh, Searing Gorge. But here, like, it's all veteran gear. So if you have, like, you know, an, an alt that really needs, or main, that really needs, like, 480 gear to kind of throw them over just to give them a boost, you can get a couple of neck pieces here, which is something you cannot get with bullion. Uh, it that's very annoying, but you cannot get nets with bullion. It's very irritating. Um, you can pick up some rings. These are all veteran. I have a set to rogue. That's the default. It's whatever you are. But there are trinkets there. Um, there's three cloaks. No, there's four cloaks. So if you want all the appearances, go for all four cloaks. You have to buy all four. They're 2,000 each. It's easy to get 2,000. Um, just for kind of purposes. futzing around, I have this much. But this is not all I have. We'll get to that in a moment. Um, May I be of service? And he's wearing, basically, the armor right here. I have the, all the sets already. Which gives you an idea. Um, but yeah, and then you'll see it for all. You can get it for all. Um, when you pick it up, it is warband until equipped. So yeah, I can buy these items if I had the echoes and then throw it into my war bank. But here's the catch. If you buy it, Your coin is there's broken. like a two hour trade window, um, a return window. So you can't put it in your war bank until that expires. So like I would just, so I would just put it in your bags, let it sit there, deal with it the next day, because that's what I did. And then throw it into the war bank and let someone who could really use it, use it. If you, you know, But you can also transfer your echoes. There's just one catch. Which I'll show you right now. So, residual memories. Whenever you see this war band transferable thing on the side, it means you can trade them. Some things can't be, like you know, add dragon owl supplies, yes. Crests, no. God damn it. Flight stones. No. No, they can't be, even though she has more and can't get any more. They can't be. Peril causal flakes, however, can be. Storm sigils. No. Which is really super frustrating, because I could really give those 44 to other characters and get the final appearances for their season one gear. Crests, of course not. Might make things easier. Mysterious fragments. That you can. Um... Which is useful, but I've already gotten a lot. So, yeah. Time Warp badges are. And I was able to actually uh, upgrade a bunch of heirlooms. 
Uh, miscellaneous Dark Moon tickets are transferable. Picurian awards are not. Iron Port tokens are not. Riders of Azeroth badge, which is the um, dragon riding races. Trader's tender is always account. Was always you. You can't really trade it. You, you can't trade this. There's nothing to trade. It's always been. PVP bloody tokens are not. Conquests are not. Honor are not. Pretty expected. Legacy. Um, let's see if they did Shadowlands. I don't think so. Cataloged research is, though. Cosmic Plus. Cypher's the first ones. Grateful Offerings are. Okay, this is good. Um, I didn't really look at this before. Soul Ashes. Soul Cinders. Stygia. Oh, God, I wish it was. Did you numbers? Tower knowledge? No. Any BFA? Metals are. That's interesting. Unfortunately, she did most of the stuff on it. Coalescing visions is not. Uh, corrupted memories is not. Echoes of Nyalatha, not. Prismatic matter pearl, no. Seafarer's doubloon, though. So the the expedition island expedition stuff is. Uh, more resources are. Does it really do we get stuff in Legion? Curious coins are. That's interesting. Um, nether shards, order of resource, size failed. I'm just gonna burn your spell. Okay, now we'll go back. We'll go back to expansions. Apexus crystals? No, unfortunately. Um, dingy iron coins. That is a rogue specific thing. Garrison resources? No. Oil? No. No. Timeless coins are, which is a uh, Pandaria currency, which is interesting. Um, then I have all the appearances now. Cataclysm. No, I didn't think so. What? Oh shit. I'm trying to complete the Argent Dawn reps and get the items. They made them transferable, which means I could funnel them to one character. Oh, snap. That's good news. Uh, Burning Crusade. Spirit charts. I'm still collecting spirit charts. Anyway, that's important to know if the champion seals are transferable. That's big. All right. Let's go turn this into Khadgar. Whoopsie. Can't go already. There you can't go. Ah, good to see you. Good to see you too, can't go. Excellent work, Arlea. Keep assisting with these radiant echoes and see if you can find some co find a common threat. They, mu be they must be connected somehow. Always happy to help. So. That's it. <laughs> you just repeat that. In each area, uh, but let's go to let's 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 go kill an Arthas. I'm gonna try to play the Zalatha thing. So here, your quest giver is Echo of the Silver Hand. Is that Bolvar? Like before he's crispy? So here, we fly around. Like this is where I know Arthur shows up later, but he should make a comment. No? No, no comment, Kedgar? Alright. There's a quest here in the um Are these Dragon. Azeroth's memories or ours. And this actually makes reference to um a quest in another area of the zone. Uh two two. It's um no this is the um this is not this zone. It's referring to um Grizzly Hills. The Kiss the Frog quest. 
to get a sword, I think. So you actually have to target a frog and then kiss it. And then it will f a little it should have a little heart and then I'll follow you. They're hard to see though cuz they I mean you could probably make a macro of the target, but I mean honestly, I have a macro for the actual quest cuz it's part of the uh it's part of the the Argent Dawn stuff. Bailey's that macro is- I've had that macro since I was playing Lich King. Suppose I have Thank a little you, heart. High Lord. Now, challenges. I will begin the ritual of I summoning. That when is I am from... done, a fearsome doom guard will appear. Prepare for oblivion! There's your Sarah, but I feel it. Aha! I have done it! Behold the absolute power! Yeah, that's happening elsewhere. That's not here. Why is it telling me it's out of range? You are bound to me, here we go. demon. And you do get the debuff, which is worse. Yes, there's five things going at once. That it always does that. So you, you have to get this frog's kissed up to a hundred, and then um, the lady will appear. The frog will turn to a lady, and then she'll be like, "Here's the sword." Like, I have no frogs. There we go. I was like, there. Got Banished a little heart on it and follows you. Another will take my place. Your world is doomed. They're really hard to see the little frog, so. Stay your arms. I yield. It might help the foes maybe a little, a little closer. I'm hoping to get her to show up here so you can see her, but if peop other people are doing it. Alright. It looks like Maiden found. Okay, someone else found the maiden. Maiden of Ashwood Lake says, and now I must return to the waters of the lake. So she was over here at some point. On to the next area. So not all of them are killing things. Some of them are just doing other things. Um, let's uh, what's over here? So this, I wouldn't call this particular echo radiant. Is completed. You have to burn corpses with uh, fire. I vaguely remember. I don't remember what that was, but I think that was an ice crown. And the bronze dragon shot. You actually have the uh, the Colosseum fight. It seems Azeroth has no need for historical You're records. fighting. Takes out a whisker to fight you. So yeah, this is the uh, this is the something of blood. That's what this is a callback to. That that seems old brat. wasn't working for a while. Yeah, it does that sometimes. So let me come out of here. It would have been fun if they added in the you see yourself in the past quest part of it, but it's fine. 
over here. Are these Azeroth's memories or ours? This is also from Zildrak, I believe. Um, I'm not gonna stay here for this. One. I'm literally just sightseeing at this point. I think that you don't need new bags, so I don't need to spend any of this on bags. She's just collecting extra echoes. These echoes must be. Contained. This one's an interesting. Um, this is Thoral. He says something at the start of it that's interesting. I'm actually hanging around the area just to, to capture that. Stay your arms. I yield. He still thunks on the floor. But then he goes sits down. So I'm gonna stay here because I do want what he says at the start. So I'll just chill here for a bit. He seems to be self-aware of what's going on with the memories. And this is a callback that I forgot. But it seems like he's aware that he's part of this, which is interesting for a keeper to make a comment on is what I'm saying. Because everyone else seems to be an echo of the, like, just like on autoplay, echo of the past. Thorum seems to be aware that he's in that echo. So, I, I, I don't know. It's just a theory. I don't know. We'll wait and see. It should show up again. I don't know. 17 minutes. 17% left. But they pop up pretty frequently. So I'm just going to sit here and wait. I don't even intend to finish it. I just want to get the bit. Sit here and watch the mammoths walk by. Here we are in sunny dragon blight. Thank you, High Lord. Now, challengers, I will begin the that ritual of summoning. When I am done, a fearsome doom well, guard here, will up. appear. Prepare for oblivion! Aha! I have done it! Behold yeah. the absolute power. This is the one that you hear going on over there. As he's summoning Lord Jaraxxus, and then you fight Lord Jaraxxus. Trifling no burning legion. That's an ice crown where the Argent Dorn is, where that whole thing is. What other ones do we have going on? That's Trials of the Argent, that's that one. Lumber collection is you're collecting art. I'm pretty sure that's from um, either Grizzly Hills or Howling Fjord. I think it's Grizzly Hills. You don't Another have will take my place. Oh, to figure out this. Okay, so it's, it didn't doomed. pop up. But I wanted to get that because it's interesting. But we're going to go beat up Arthas now. It's here for 40 minutes, so I'll go over there after it to see if it's there. Uh, but let's go Let's go beat up some Arthas. Let's go watch some folks still stand in defile. I forgot that I changed that. I changed my stealth puffin. Face now, your tragic end. I messed up my keybinds today, which is driving me crazy. They do not carry you away and drop you off the edge because you're not shooting the um, So I'm getting gear that I can't even use, but it's all warband, so I'm just going to put that in the, uh, the warbank. So I'm going to fly over to where Thorin is. Over this direction, though, we'll take a side detour over here is um some like nerubian fun also interesting considering where we're going next no time for nostalgia champion <laughs> i do like when he chides you about that it's like who's being nostalgic about giant bugs not me but let's go over here because i do want to see the thor on one i do want to catch the start of that
This is interesting that you do spend a lot of time dealing with Dragonflight. I mean, it was a Dragonflight expansion, so. But it does come up. The Mega Dungeon. You have to go back to Galakron. Galakron's over there. Over, over yonder. Over yonder. Come on, Thorm. Show up. Don't give me a lot to edit. Show up. I'm trying to, like, show certain things in a certain order so that my editing is not too painful. Man, I can't believe the war with it is so soon. I can and I can't. Come on, where are you, Thor? Somebody clear a zone so we can get this one. By fire be purged, which is what Ragnaros says, but it's not that. And sometimes the names are referring back to the actual quest, but I remember, I, for some reason I think that's a quest line. You do... No. You do... Here, near Scourgeholm. When you first come in, Crusader's Pinnacle, you have to... There's a lot of... Scourge have to deal with? I want to say that's it. Come on, pop. Pop so I can go to another character. I'm going to go to a character that Anduin doesn't know next. And then I'm, I'm just gonna do it and not do not do all the fancy stuff. Just get to the doing this quest, which I already you know. Doing a kill the boss. I'm not even gonna do the kill the boss. I'm just gonna have her accept the killing the boss part. <laughs> wow, that took people a long time. Okay, here we go. Oh, Listen to what he says. I remember this one. I remember you in the mountains, but you, what is this? Where See? Are... I don't know if that's something he says originally. Well, I was killing someone. Um, I don't know if that's something he said originally as part of the. Uh... I yield. So, yeah, I don't. I forget if it's something he's. Yeah, Stormix. I forget if that's something he says originally and they're just replaying it, or if it's something new for this. I haven't confirmed, but it's interesting if it is new. Because it's like, are you self aware of what's going on for him? Because that's kind of freaky. So I'm going to actually exit here. I never remember which one is the actual portal. No, it's facing north, I believe. Is this right? This is yes. It's a northern doorway is always the portal out. Actually, I probably could have just gone to... I did turn it into to Khadgar already. Oh, but there's one thing I wanted to show you. But you know what? I'll do it. I'll do it on the next character, because the next character can benefit from purchasing this stuff. So, just to recap, um, and she turned it in here. So she's good to go. And she's probably not going to be doing any more. You know what? She's going to do the achievement, which is killing one boss in each area. Um, so I'll leave her here for that. But, because why not? Even though it's account-wide, I want to get it on her too. So you'll notice here also you can upgrade your armor. 
Beskarn and Kuzlith are here, are here. So that's... You do get stones for this. You do get... I believe you get, uh... Yeah, you get, uh, um, Welpings Awaken Crest. You cannot get worms or aspects. I have to run her through, uh, Mythic Plus again. I do want to try to work on that today. Not today. This weekend. Um... So we're going to leave her here, and we're going to log out. And we're going to hop on my pally, who is in desperate need of gear. Uh, Beathis, she's a dwarf. I do want to bring her into the mix this time. So... Beathis. I do want to bring her into um, the War Within. I, I, even though I know I'm going to play my Earthen... I do want to bring her in. I've had her forever. Um, she might get the Echoes quest coming too. I think I deleted hers as well. Meet me in Silithus. Perhaps Azeroth's speaker can shed some light on what this warning might mean. Yeah, I don't know why the, the voice acting cuts out at the start of that. But um, you'll know she has the Harbinger because she hasn't done it yet. So, I mean, I don't even think she can take the Hearthstone, but... We're just going to go to Silithus because I already know from experience no one is in, in Dalaran. Well, yeah, let's do this. Let's take the Hearthstone to Dalaran. If, if you don't already have it as a toy, she does because she's done the Legion quests, but I want to try. I do want to try a couple of little things. So I'm going to take that. This is the one that you get to use for the Harbinger. But when you go in, it's the same deal. But if I were to go here, unless they fixed it, you'll see the area over here is for the Harbinger. But Illyria's not there. What's his face is in here talking all shady talk? She hasn't done much of Legion, so her artifacts are not there. And, um. There's Kedgar. He's not here. There's Kedgar. So. You, you can't do this first. Even if you get it first, you can't do it first. Once you hit 70, you're going to have to do syllabus first. But you will. Don't worry. Don't worry. You can do it. You can do it right now. It's not going to take that long. I'm not going to take nearly as long as I have already. All two hours I've already taken up doing this. But I want to see something. This is going to confirm. Still same. I could swear when I did that on the beta, Cadgar was in there too, and I was like, my dude, why are you everywhere? Everyone is the same. Nothing else is different. So now we're going to go to Silithus. No go to hold. Same thing happens, in case you're curious. So we're not going to do that again. Another vision. You saw it too. They're growing stronger. So let me go talk to Andy. A just cause is always worth fighting for. So different dialogue here. Um, slightly different, but it's nice touch. Um, it seems destiny has brought us all here. No friend language. They call it the Radiant Song, yet it fills me with dread. What could it be warning us of? I've heard the King of Stormwind has long been missing. 
Anduin smiles wearily. Missing! You put it so nicely. I ran from my kingdom, from the Alliance, from myself. But I was sent this vision for a reason. I can't run. Not from this. So it's pretty much the same, except he clearly has different language if he's the more he familiar serves. with your character. Banth has done a lot of the content, but I can't think for the life of me what content she hasn't done that would get that dialogue. And at first I thought, oh, maybe that's what you use for new characters and horde. Nope. About to prove that in about a second. The way forward will not be possible. This is all the same. We'll talk the to Alliance you. will endure. For Azeroth. Be careful who you trust. I will never forget. Look, Tom. So their, their dialogue doesn't change any. Together, we are strong. I'm going to check in case you're curious if the brawl has anything different to say to Horn. I don't think so. Let, let's hope Magni has some answers. I hear no one's seen him for a few years. He'll be there. He has to be. So I'm just laughing at this this guild name utterly metered. Is it a, is it a guild of Torin? It's a troll. But I can appreciate much appreciate. So I don't think they don't say it. they don't have any additions. Well but. met. No. For Azeroth. Control your power. Or it will control you. Now which, how will Jaina ascend the stairs this time? They ain't even here. They're already here waiting for me. All right. Maybe I took too long. I will do what I can. I know what must be done. Together. I'm gonna be quiet and just do the quest. No rest for we heroes, hey champion. Speaking to me. After all I gave, she left me like this, unable to feel the warmth of my kin's embrace. So, let's be clear I'm doing this for all of you, not for her. What would you ask the daughter of the sea? Safe journey to you. Let honor guide I just was checking to see if they had anything to say in the brief window just on his mood and why it's so foul. Look, I'm not dead yet. When the world is Azeroth! Speak to me! What are you trying to tell us? I can hear her voice! I can see it! The place she's calling us to! Where, Magni? Where must we go? It's cold! <laughs> Magni! He's alive, but barely.
from Khan. For Azeroth. A king is only as noble as the causes he serves. Be careful who you trust. We all have our costs. I will never forget. Hopefully we can revive him. Meet us in Dalaran when you're able. He tried to commune directly with Azeroth. It seems the strain was too much. Oh, da. What have you done to yourself this time? Let's get to work. It is a world of wonder. Remain vigilant. Greetings, friend. Victory in the light. Let honor guide your path. A single spark can set the world aflame. Let's get down to business then. You made oh, you'll likely find Dagrin with his nose in a book. It's why he insisted we come to Dalaran. And now, listen, you old coot. I know you always meant right by me. You didn't know that I chose to stay with the Dark Irons. That Dagrin and I were in love. Whatever your intentions were, my husband died. Because of you, I hated you for taking him from me. My anger built a wall neither of us could ever get through. And now, we may never get the chance. But my son, my little Dagrin, he needs you. I guess so do I, loath as I am to admit it. You were never the best father. But you can still be a good granda. So please, wake up. We will defend Azeroth together. So I can't start the uh, Echo's quest until I go get Dagran and uh, Bran. Have you seen these new tomes, Uncle Bran? They must be from Drenton's library. Did you find something? Oh, are you headed out? You'll find me wherever the action is. 
truth is out there. I hope Granddad's all right. I never got to spend much time with him. Don't worry, lad. Magni's made of stern stuff. Uh, pardon the pun. Give me something to figure out. I need some time to think. Keep your eyes on the horizon. I dismiss you. We will survive. We always do. as a pet. Maybe we could train Stinky. Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go and take some of their toy. Unless they train a pet that looks a lot like Stinky. But I wouldn't, it wouldn't surprise me. There's a lot of raid bosses that can be tamed as pets now. So anyway. Uh, now you get the option to take this quest. Ah, good to see you. Even though on top, you'll see now there's Illyria Windrunner should be there. So I think... Yeah, she's here now. And then you have totally not suspicious at all, Drendon. You can be sure of that. You are sus as F. That's all I'm saying. So you can continue here. And there's probably another Kaga said over you here. would come. Yes. I thought it best to wait Chad for you. goes over here, too. We're not going to do that tonight. I'll do that on her some other time. What I'm going to do is... I'm going to accept the quest. I'm going to throw her into uh, the Radiant Echoes so I could show you how you do a transfer. Because you can't transfer if you don't have the money yet. So if I were to go to currency... Um, it's not even here yet. You can't even find it. So it has to be there for you to trade it. And you can only accept it. Like you can only take it to yourself. You can't give it to someone else. So, which I'm sure is just security against the weirdness. So, we're still in Ice Crown, I believe. Later on, Another after will stream, take my place. Your world I'm is going doomed. to run her through uh, Amir Drasil. See if maybe, maybe the sword will drop for her. Here maybe we go Furlat, again. Sorry. Quite literally. Maybe Furlat would drop. So you get a little torch to burn. Maybe this is actually from Stormpeak? I forget. Anyway, you're supposed to burn corpses. It's mixed in with the mobs that are only here, so it's a little weird. I just, like, randomly throw... I think what happens is you have to... This is the one... No, I think actually this is the one in my friend. Uh... Like, there's a big fight, and then you have to go and burn the corpses so that they don't get resurrected into the character. Like, each one of these little things drops. Someone's got the fishy! I can hear it. Wee -wee 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 -wee. Geared her, geared her up slightly today. She's definitely neglected, though. I really do want to try to play her. 
play here a little bit. I'm not sure who's going in, other than Arleia and the turret, who always go in, but I do want to play with my new Earth in. But I feel that there has to be at least one of my dwarves there, and I've only got two before my Earth in. Um, I don't even need yet here. It's so many cards in the Um. The other one's a Dark Iron. So she's, in, she's also a Shaman. So she's a contender. Looks like it's still members. Stay your arms. I yield. So you'll hear Thorim and Jaraxxus throughout, regardless of where you are, you'll hear them. I don't even know if the fire does anything, if the living is to unlit whatever they are, but it's fun to throw fire boat. The funny thing is, is that it makes a broken bottle sound like you're throwing a Molotov cocktail, but the, um, it's very clearly a Lickin's torch, so why it sounds like a Molotov cocktail being thrown, I don't know. There's some, um, criticism that this is too much like previous events, but I'm like, you know what? It's a couple of weeks of grinding to grind and I'm, I'm that no one's gonna ever see again. It's not it's gonna disappear from the game. You either do it or you don't. You know, it's not something that Cold Leaper. Oh that's from uh what is just Saren. Maybe it's from that. That's up that's up in Ice Crown too. That's, it's actually the, the dungeon, I think. <sighs> oh, this one's taking a long time. I don't feel like doing it anymore. I'm gonna go over here. Thank you, High Lord. Now, challengers, I will begin the ritual of summoning. Are these when Azeroth's I am done, memories? A fearsome doom oh. guard will appear. So this is uh. Prepare for oblivion. Uh, will you save the Merlots? Aha! I have done it. Behold the absolute the power. The They're over by. Uh, once I'm done being attacked by Krabs. Trifling gnome! You think your dragons will be your overlord of the Burning Legion! You're trying to do some low level characters, it's very archy. Alright, so I'm just trying to feed these poor little Murloc babies. If they make the noise. And you'll see there's like one plus cap over is an echo. So then she actually has some echo, I'll show you in a moment. We are all haunted by the memories of North Ren. And now they've come to life. Yeah, I'm glad I got that little bit. Another will take my place. I do want to get the Your red rose, but we might actually doomed. be able to. There's only nine more minutes of, of here. So then I jump on my tour and Yay, the Lich King! Alright, let's go kill let's go kill Arthas again. So yeah, this is what it is. Um I do uh, thankfully Searing Gorge is next, so at least we get all three. Um Bosses, so. Face now your 
run to file out in this version, you'll see there's a purple circle around the circle that's about to drop. People don't, not everybody runs it out though. So it's actually an easier to file. A, a gentler to file. Which I'm hoping is because they realize because now that Dragonflight is the leveling expansion, default leveling expansion, my knife to file is still in the game. But I forget, the, I think the time rips are in game. So she got stuff too. So hopefully she can use this. She got a hammer. Good. I'm glad she got a hammer. I'm very, I'm very big on, well, I can transmog to hammer, but I'd like my daughters to have hammers. It only seems proper. I, again, apologize to any Scottish people listening to this. My deepest, most sincere apologies. So we're actually going to gear her up a little bit so I can show you all this fun. Um, because she's in desperate need of a new character. And later on I'm throwing her through a mirror soul. LFR, nothing too fancy. So she did get some drops. She got a two-handed mace. Which will do. She had a polearm. And then this is plate. Champion, nice. So when this drops, when you get the chest that drops, it drops champion gear. So she now has boots. What are her boots currently? Varun. So she'll have to upgrade those. Currently in a better place. I can upgrade it right here. Can I? What brings you here? Uh, May we all find what we seek. So let's see what I can do. And then I could also um, catalyst this, so. Wait, she doesn't have enough yet anyway. Um, how about a hammer? Let's throw the last one up there at the hammer. Not bad. She's not 471. Best she started today at 250. <laughs> so not bad. Um, and then we're just going to keep her down here for now. But actually, no, she has. I wanted to her to buy some of the echoes. Browse at your leisure, friend. So, showing what else could she really benefit from? Uh, she's got this trash earring that's 428, but let's see what's really bad. Um, 476 is okay for raids. 473, 467, 502 was good. She's got this choker that's 476. The helm. Let's deal with the helm. So, she needs a new helm. She does not have enough for a helm currently. That's a risk. This is only 200. Um, 2,000 rather. And a helm. The helm is 5,000. So she could, she needs some, she needs some echoes. Well. Now, now that she has some echoes, this is what you do. You go to currency. Now that she has them, you see the war within now has its has a slot. You click on it, click transfer, and it's clicking from it's going from another character to her. So what you do is it's it's a little weird. Stick with me. You put in the amount you want to transfer. I like to leave a little bit in the other person's account in case I need to transfer back and forth, because once you drain them, the war within currency disappears. So We'll put 9400 9, because we do want to get her a couple of pieces. Um, and then you hit enter or return. And then it'll show down here that his new balance will be 79. Beatha's new balance will be 11,067. You hit confirm. Now you have to do each one of these individually. So if I were to pull something from Railton as well. I mean, I got a few people I could pull from, but let's pull from Railton because 
She doesn't really need anything at the moment. So let's pull four, another 4,000 from her. And confirm. And now we've got 15,000 that we can spend. We have reasonable prices. So we're going to get the helm first, because that's important. Um, chest. I can never remember what's where. This is the head, so we'll grab that right now. I'm going to sell this spear. I'm not going to use it again. I'm going to sell these feet. I love when the cats decide to Yes, it is the it is the headless horseman head. That's that's what we're talking about here. That's how dire the situation is. She has she's using the horrific hood from season two. From last Halloween. Last Hollow's End rather. So now now she's got a head. Let's get maybe get her another well let's look at a wrist. Get her a wrist. We'll get her wrist up. The wrist was only two thousand. My goal here is to get, like, explore and adventure gear out. Just. So we got that. Ah, she needs a cape. A cape would do seven. I think this is the best one. That's another 2,000. And then we got a cape on her. And see, she got, no, that, yeah, Draconically Epic. Um, she got the achievement. So now she just needs a, oh, her chest is, her chest is dire. I should see what's actually in the bank, but I don't think there's a chest piece there. Mm. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get... A ring and a neck. Let's get a ring and a neck. Let's get the neck first. Neck is done. And how much have we got? Oh, we got enough for a ring. What ring would be the best at this point? 37. I mean, honestly, probably there are better ring options from. But we just want to get her all the way to... We want her to have veteran on everything. Is what we want. And then I will sell all this junk. I'm not selling the headless person to tell until she has another one. Um, we could also buy her a bag if we wanted to. Um, she could use a better region bag. So let's buy her a region bag. And that pretty much used it. Yay, the cat. That pretty much spent all Thank her stuff you for up. Browsing. We have 17 seconds until the next zone. Do we want to go into Searing Gorge and never have fun in Searing Gorge? She's kind of in half armor here now. I want to, I did want to go look, because she does need a chest piece. You will show the proper respect. I'm going to go look. I think there might be a chest in the bank. Yeah, Drendon, I see you. I see you, Drendon. Don't worry. What I will do later is going to the Catalyst and all that fun stuff. I will not do that on the stream. We all have our chores. You don't need to see my chores. And yes, I could use the Warbank distance, whatever, but the bank is right over here and there's a cooldown for the, the toy, so... I'd rather just go to the real bank and then not worry about a cooldown. Trade services is up. Uh oh. We have to adjust that setting. Hi. Well met. Warbank. Now, I think it says Warbank because I have the add on that its only purpose is to change Warband Bank to Warbank. <laughs> That person's doing God was God's work. I appreciate it. I also have these bags here. I could easily just drop into the slots. And... Yep, I'm not making them for my health, so let me just grab those. Oh, 
grab two of those. Um, but let's go to gear. Plate? Oh, I had a plate helm, damn it. I had another plate helm, but I have a chest. And that's why we're here. I have two helms. I didn't need to buy those helms. Go with honor, friend. Buy it, cat. I'm up gear I'm upgrading my back phone. The cats are now gonna get into fights. Yay. This is not your preferred armor type? Oh, it's male. Oh. Yeah, screw that. Fooey. I thought I put mail is supposed to be a separate column. I have a system. You need to pay attention to it. Me. Me. I me need to pay attention to it. This is the weapon slot. This is my see, this is where I put cloth. This is where I put leather. Here's where I put chain. Here's where I put plate. And I had the mail and the I had the mail in the plate. So I do have to know. Oh god, this cat. I do need to. I do need to uh for the alliance. Trade some more. But let me actually since I'm here. Light be with you. I can upgrade my bags. Really, cats? They do this every night. They've been fed. What is your problem? Nether weave bags I've gotten here. Iron Forge Satchel. That's how behind our bags are. Ogre Diving Cat. We don't need the Frost Weave Bag. We are going to hold on to Iron Weave stuff. I don't think I can even sell that. And I like I like to hold on to the the pre-launch Dragon Flight Regent Bag <laughs> for some reason. All right, let's go back, trade some more. See, she's got part of the set on. Let me, sh I'll show you the sets. These are War Within sets. You can't even do those. It's an Island Defender. So this is the plate set. This is on a dwarf paladin. Um, but you can view now everyone. So Warrior, it looks the same because it's plate. Hunter's Chain. You kind of have to like, Click on it again to see the chain. Um, rogue is leather. Then you click on it, you can see the rogue. And let's find a priest. There we go, cloth. Click on it and you can see the priest. Pretty cool. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll change her mog back in a second. What I wanna do is uh, see if I can buy her the proper chess piece. So that we can round out her set, and then I'll I'll leave her here. Well, now I guess I can do Searing Gorge too, huh? Um. Yeah, might as well kill Ragnaros. Oh, I haven't even picked up the quest from him yet, so I I should I do need there to do remains it. Much to be Memories done. of adventures. Be past, mindful so he has of your to do duty. It. So cool. On each one of the characters I brought out. Well, on two characters so far, I still have to bring out the third. Um I get all three bosses. Cool. That saves me. Transfer. I think it was five thousand, so. Arleia has 4,000. She's not going to need any. Oh, I forgot to confirm. Yeah, don't hit transfer again. Hit confirm. Here. That gets you your... your so. Browse now... Into Plate, chest, yes. Your coin is always welcome.
Cool. So now she should have all veteran gear, so she's good there. So let's go to... And they rotate. Uh, so you have Searing Gorge, Duskwall Marsh, and then uh, Dragon Blight. So we're going to go kill Ragnaros. Get a trifecta. And I'll try to fly around the area so you see what's in them too. I... I think I think my cat found a toy, his favorite toy. He makes a big fuss whenever he finds his toy. He goes, walks around like meow, 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 yeah. What? So here we have. I don't here really we go this. again, quite literally. This is there's trogs that are caffeinated. I vaguely remember this quest. I don't think it's in the game anymore. I think it's an old quest. Um, that could just have forgotten it. It's been a while since I've done. Anyway, you're slippery. You're slippery. Um, this yellow stuff in the ground is slippery. It's... And the trogs hit you and bounce you all over the place. The goal is you have to... There's barrels. I'm trying to find a barrel to show you, but you do. But you have to pick, click on the barrel and then carry it up the stairs. That part I remember, so I do remember that quest of having to ca run stuff up the stairs. I, I forget the this the trogs being caffeinated. There's I found one of the bar barrels. Can't give scalding mover. This one has been solved, so it doesn't. All right. Over here we have. These now, echoes must be contained. Memories of Hakkar. One thing to note. Corrupted blood is a thing. And you can transfer it. And people were doing that a lot the other day. By the way, um, you'll notice I'm not entirely participating. I'm just flying around. I will still get credit for it. So if you are on a real low beat, you just cannot survive. Oh, look, someone, someone's got... Someone's flagged with PvP. Awesome. Corrupted blood. Less blood siphon, you can't move. Corrupted blood is enough. If I get killed, I'll PvP because of these idiots. And I don't know, it may not be into- oh, here we go. Corrupted blood? Alright, we need to get away from each other. We're corrupted. Please, don't transfer to one another. Get the hell away from me. And let it drop off. Or else we'd be infecting each other forever. And there was actually a, uh, if you don't know, look it up. Corrupted blood. Uh, it, it was used as a test aid to determine how, um, epidemic spread. Famous? Not kidding. It exists. I wouldn't call this particular echo radiant. So this is hunting leper gnomes? Oh wait, no, no. This is the poisoning pumpkins. I I don't understand it. I, I don't I vaguely remember this one. Yeah, it's it's probably a horde quest. You're probably poisoning the um, alliance pumpkins. Fire Lord Ragnaros returns. Oh, Ragnaros is back. Battle. Oh, we didn't have to do this for too long. Um, and then I'm going to run one more character through with less talking. And then we take a break. And then we're going to get on Hive on and hopefully it won't take too long. There's a ton. There's a, they did add this very helpful shield. They did this in, in uh, Remix as well uh, to allow folks to get to a site. And these days in Remix, everything's one-shotted. I don't even actively kill things anymore. Things get me like that. Oh, Ragnaros. 
Show us your legs. This is the original control. Another person. You know what happens? Though, but I noticed there are people that have flagged the TV here. Oh, good battle staff. I don't need it, but I'll throw that I'll throw that in the bank. This stuff that drops is all warbat all warbat war war Bam, bam. Ragnaros threatened to swallow as war, bam, bam. in flame. War, bam, bam. War, no wonder bam. she war, bam, bam. Him. Um. So you can put it in there. I'm putting it in there for other people to mess with. Like the battle staff, I may throw that on my monk, but I don't think the staff is good for Nora Harso. We'll see. Um. And then she'll just now when you turn this in, he's up here. Let's get to work. It is a and that's world that. of a wonder. I'm gonna leave her here for now. I'll pick her up later. Um, because I want to go in on one more. Let's get Matt out. Granny and Mataro are going to get shifted down once the War Within starts. They're not the main group going in. I do not know who's going to be here and here. These two are first. There are people that are upset about the favorite screen. I'm like, no, you can just go date characters. There is a vision being seen across Azeroth. A radiant song. We believe it's a warning. Meet me in Silithus. We must ask Azeroth's speaker what this vision means. So Thrall contacts you if you're Horde, of course. Um, why can't I? I'm trying to, there we go. <laughs> I was like, I'm trying to get it out of Spirit Wolf. Um, so let's accept, of course. And she hasn't done uh, the Harbinger yet. But same thing. Now keep in mind, she's Horde. But she's also like, I consider her my second main. Another vision. You saw it too. They're growing stronger. So before we go talk to Thrall, has the quest turn in because he called you here. But let's go talk to now I'm oh god who put me as a witch? They made me a witch. We can't do this as a witch. Alright. A witch revealed as a witch in disguise. Whatever toy that is, I want it, but we're not we're not going we're not doing this as a witch. So Sometimes we must fight for what we believe It's in. been too long, my friend. It seems destiny has brought us both here. They're calling it the Radiant Song, yet it fills me with dread. So, or yet, dot, 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 it fills me with dread. Um, which seems a little bit more personal than the I don't know you version. But she's very clearly a Tauren. She's bored. So it's not faction dependent. What changes the dialogue? I wish I knew what it was. I'd love to know. I just wonder for nerdy reasons only. Where have you been? And with smiles early, nowhere in particular, no need for a destination. I was only trying to run from my kingdom, from the alliance, from myself. But I was sent this vision for a reason. I can't keep running. Not from this. 
Be vigilant. So, sir, they don't have anything new to say, so I'm just I will go do what this. I can. The Alliance will endure. Together, we are strong. Well, since eternity, this is diff slightly different. We're all here. Good. Let's find out what the Radiant Song is trying to tell us. For Azeroth. A poor reception. Let honor guide your path. There's strong evidence that the Radiant Song is a warning from Azeroth herself, a cry for help. That's why we're here. If this vision truly is Azeroth's message, Magni will know what she's trying to tell us. He should be in the chamber of the heart. Let's go. Go to the heart of the chamber. Go to the heart chamber to ask Magni for help deciphering the Radiant Song. For Let's hope Magni has some answers. I hear no one's seen him for a few years. He'll be there. He has to be. Let's say he's there. So we go in. Magni, we've been trying to re- If this is about the visions, I'm nae interested. Leave me alone. She's walking up the stairs. She's walking up the stairs. She's not gliding. Azeroth needs its speaker. And so do we. I'm glad I got one where she's she's moving normally. And not just appearing and just not. So she walked up the stairs like everybody else there. That's how it should be. That's how it was. Stormwind honors your service to the Alliance. <laughs> okay. Stormwind control honors my power, service to the Alliance. Or it will control you. Torrin. Torrin. They gotta change those, but then again, you still have Forsaken wandering around saying victory for Sylvanas, so. Greetings, friend. Someone needs to do a find replace. Never lose hope. I know what must be done. Together. Sometimes destiny whispers, sometimes she shouts. Keep fighting, champion. Speaker of Azeroth! <laughs> she hasn't been speaking to me. After all I gave, she left me like this. Unable to feel the warmth of my kin's embrace. I'm doing this for all of you, not for her. Well, out with it. Azeroth, speak to me. What are you trying to tell us? I can hear her voice. I can see it! The place she's calling us to! Where, Magni? Where must we go? It's cold! <laughs> Magni! He's alive. But barely. The true battle lies ahead. We all have our ghosts. Be careful who you trust. The Alliance will endure. A single spark can set the- Hopefully we can revive him. Meet us in Dalaran when you're able.
He tried to commune directly with Azeroth. It seems the strain was too much. Oh, da. What have you done to yourself this time? Stormwind will endure. For Azeroth. I know what must be done. Ah, good to see you. Always happy to help. Remain vigilant. Best mind your manners in the presence of a queen. The th oh, you'll likely find Dagrin with his nose in a book. It's why he insisted we come to Dalaran. Now, listen, you old coot. I know you always meant right by me. You didn't know that I chose to stay with the Dark Irons. That Dagrin and I were in love. Whatever your intentions were, my husband died because of you. I hated you for taking him from me. My anger built a wall neither of us could ever get through. And now... We may never get the chance, but my son, my little Dagrin, he needs you. I guess so do I, loath as I am to admit it. You were never the best father, but you can still be a good granda. So please, wake up. Have you seen these new tomes, Uncle Bran? They must be from Drendon's library. So much to discuss. Keep your eyes open. Travel safe! I hope Granda's all right. I never got to spend much time with them. Don't worry, lad. Magni's made of stern stuff. Uh, pardon the pun. Well, I'm listening. I dismiss you. Mind yourself, champion. We need you. If you hear anything I need, let me know. There remains much to be done. Be mindful of your duty. Just being quiet now. <laughs> Finishing this up. And everything in my house is noisy right now, so that's why. What a peculiar memory for Azeroth to show us.
So the trick to that one is to aim for the little barricades and kind of like bounce off them. Bank off them. Different ones are here. Hogger is Azeroth's here. memories so, are ours. This one is. I know Stitches is here. This is the pumpkins again. So this is, I believe, is up north somewhere. It's Forsaken and stuff. I'm sorry. I don't really play Forsaken. <laughs> I know I've done the quest. It seems familiar. It was a long time ago when I last touched it, so I appreciate it's here. Who's this? Remembered Ghoul. Is it Anderhal, maybe? Is that from Anderhal, perhaps? Plaguelands? That would make sense if they put something kind of... No, that's the brew. We're not doing the brew. Um, Are these Azeroth's memories? Is this leper gnomes? Or ours? Yeah. So when you get these guys, you can hunt them. But it's like a long cooldown for them. So while it's great, you can hunt them. It takes forever. Pretty sure that's around gadgets. So that's it. Okay, let's see what's over here. Oh, these echoes must be contained. Green Hills of Stranglethorn, and yes, the pages dropped. Though I did want to try to get Bengalashes here as a rare. But it looks like they're going to finish that one up soon anyway. I mean, we're at 56. But I want to try to. I tried doing Bengalash on a low level character, and that was. That was bad. That was. That hurt. Bengalash is from, uh. Not Strangle. Northern Stranglethorn. I've done the Green Hills of Stranglethorn a million times, so. <gasps> that I one I remember. I this one. I, I just finished that one. I know this is Stitches. That's all I can tell you. This is Stitches. Ah, oh, I remember this one. And... Hogger! And there's other stuff happening. Mobile dust at cold board. Yeah, that's the guy in your chair. So it's like El oh, this is like Elwyn Forest, this whole area. It's basically a memory of Elwyn. Okay, is it back? Here we go again. I want Bank Quite ah. literally. No. Get a Bank I'm never going to get this rare. Um, I don't know if you get anything for getting the rares. That's the thing. I don't know if you get anything for the rares. You get extra stuff that's more of an item drop, potential item drop, but. Yeah, that was ridiculous. I was way okay. What's super tricky? What's super tricky is, and those pile up in your bags. What's super tricky is, um, on lower level characters, the regular mobs can hurt you, so you have to be careful. It's like it's one thing when I'm on. Oh, there's Bangalash. So here's Bangalash. 
who I'm determined to, to get. I should have the power to still move Bank Flash. I have to look up and see which areas have which echoes have rares. I mean, I get reading echoes from it. I got 25. And more pages, which I will sell later. I'm not too concerned about that one. It seems Azeroth has There's no stitches. need for historical records. The stitches is here. Yes, do I happen to remember Alliance side better than Horde? Yes, I admit it. It's not a bias, it's just how things turned out. These echoes must My be was in Okay, we're almost down to Ragnaros. Well, I'm glad that we got to see some of the other ones up here. Got to see Hogger, Stitches, Benglash. There is a rare that pops up here, but I don't see it. I've killed that one about a million times, so. So I'm not so worried about it. I don't think there's an achievement for getting all the rares. I think that would be kind of... Oh, I got some My shoes. I got some top returns. shoes. Brace for battle. That's good. I can pass that along. I can pass that along. Fire elemental out to fight dragons? Is it worth it? Feels wrong. One of the earliest expanding ring boss fights. You'll notice. Okay, it's an expanding ring, it's an alternating ring, which is a small one. Not too dissimilar. Azeroth's memory of the oh, Fire she got more stuff. is not but Yay. ashes now. Alright, so we'll hand that in. I wonder what Azeroth is trying to tell us with these echoes. And I will toss this. I will toss. I will. I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna do the harbinger quest tonight on her. But we will. Um, I'll put it back in Veldrak and after handing this into Gadgar, and then put it in the bank for anyone else. Let's get to work. Always happy and to help. And she's done it now. Yay! So let's get her back to. She's got a lot of quests in her objectives. I'm just gonna do this. Yes, there are Shadowlands over there. I have keep trying to have her finish up some Shadowlands stuff. But, you know, they're going through a new expansion, and now what? Now I gotta focus on that. So she'll she'll need a little... She'll pick away at the Shadowlands stuff. 
during downtimes, which now is not downtime, but down it might become soon. I'm gonna run out of things to actually do.